Hey y'all, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're interested in seeing what I made for this week, then just keep on watching. I'm starting off with seven of these Dollar Tree mirrors. So first thing I'm going to do is remove the plastic from all the mirrors. Next, I'm taking some of this newspaper and I'm going to cut them in circles to cover the mirror so the mirror doesn't get the white acrylic paint on them. Now I'm taking some of this white acrylic paint that I picked up from the Dollar Tree. I'm going to create a mixture with this and also some red glitter to cover the outside of my mirrors. I created a mixture of Mod Podge red glitter glue and also glitter because the glitter that I initially put around the mirror frames, that glitter didn't come out too well. You can barely see it. So now I'm just adding extra glitter around my mirror frames, which this mixture didn't take effect at all either. You can see the glitter a little better with this mixture but it wasn't really given the effect that I actually wanted but it's okay. I'm using some of these craft clamps that I picked up from the Dollar Tree to help mold my mirrors together. So now I'm just removing the clamps and I'm taking my popsicle sticks and an E6000 glue and hot glue to the back of my mirrors for additional support.
I already laid my acrylic gems out before gluing them down, which I forgot that you cannot use hot glue on these acrylic gems or else the gems will fade. I realized that after gluing this first one down, so from here on out, you will see me using E6000 glue only. If you watched my previous video, then you may have seen these red LED lights. I ordered these from Amazon. So now you just see me gluing the LED lights around the mirrors and I'm starting from the bottom, going all the way to the top. Now I'm taking these peppermints and I'm going to spell the word welcome on top of my mirrors. Once I finished gluing all my peppermints down, removed any glue strings, and cleaned my mirrors, I had something that looked like this. I did end up adding the red Merry Christmas ribbon and I also topped it off with a Santa hat. Now this welcome sign isn't 100% sturdy, but it's sturdy enough. Now, if you guys wanted to recreate this project on your own, don't just use the popsicle sticks alone because it's not gonna be 100% sturdy. But tell me what you guys think about this week's projects down in the comments. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And hit that notification bell so you don't miss my next video. Thanks for watching.